with Standing Stone Kennels and Pro Staff with DT Systems, and I've got Hex with me again today. This little guy is 17 weeks old, and we've been working on collar conditioning for recall. Now it's time to incorporate that collar conditioning to recall into a retrieving session. We're using DT Systems H2O 1820E collar today with the Vibrate and a DT Systems puppy size bumper. Uh, so the thing to remember is as soon as he goes out and picks up that bumper, that Vibrate's gonna turn on until he completes the recall because retrieving, like I've mentioned before, is two parts. The desire to go out, pick something up and carry it around, and then the cooperation and obedience now with the collar conditioning to bring that back to us. So we're gonna do that with him today. If he would drop the bumper for any reason, I still need him to complete that recall because that's what we're collar conditioning. Okay, buddy, let's get this bumper. Hex, ready? Okay. So as soon as he gets the bumper in his mouth, Vibrate's gonna turn on, it's on here. Good boy, all the way back to me. Good job, good job. Okay, I'm gonna take that bumper, good. Ready, let's do another one, okay. Vibrates on here. Good boy, good boy, good. Get a hold of that bumper. We can play a little tug still, make this game fun. Make sure he's still holding on to it really well. Good boy. And then if he's got a vice grip on it or it's hard to get from him, you can just pick up on his flank a little bit. He'll turn to look at that and you can get the bumper. Ready? Let's do another one. Okay. Making those bumpers bounce and roll is really exciting for these puppies. It incites a little more prey drive because they see a little more movement. So vibrate hasn't shut off. Hex, come on puppy, puppy. So he set the bumper down. He picked it back up. Vibrate hasn't shut off. Come here, good boy. Because he needs to complete the recall. Even if he had decided to leave that bumper, he still needs to complete the recall. Good job, good job. We're gonna do one more, see if we can get a little bit better completed retrieve and end on a good note with this retrieving session. Ready, buddy? Ready? Okay. Here, good boy. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh. here, good. So I tried to redirect him when I thought he looked like he was gonna veer off kind of and skirt past me even though he was feeling the vibrate. I tried to ah, uh, ah, uh, interrupt that decision of his and redirect him back to me, which he did. So that was a great finished retrieve. Good job, buddy. Good job. I'm gonna take that, just picking up on his flank a little bit. He turns to look, I get the bumper, no problem. So he had a great session with his retrieving and collar conditioning combined today. I'm really happy with what that looked like and we're gonna continue incorporating collar conditioning into all of the rest of his retrieving sessions. Until next time, I'm Cat the Dog Trainer. This little guy is Hex and we'll see you in the next video.